So the Windows Insider is an open software testing program by Microsoft that allows users who own a valid license of Windows 11, Windows 10 or Windows Server to register for pre-release builds of the operating system previously only accessible to software developers. So first thing we are going to do once we are on our desktop screen is to go over to our Windows menu icon and click on it. Then locate your settings app. You can find it at the left hand side of your Windows menu. Or you type or you search for your settings app using the windows magnifying glass icon and you should find your settings app just right here so launch your settings app and once you're on this page right here you're going to find the update and security click on the update and security and just on the left hand side of your screen you're going to find the windows insider program as the last option there click on it then over to the right hand side you're going to find the get started button right there so guys this is like the most crucial stage so we like need to focus on the screen so it says over here join the windows insider program to get preview builds of windows 10 and provide feedback to help make windows better so just click on your get started so right here it says pick an account to get started and we are going to be linking our microsoft account so if you don't have one also sign up for one so So once you're done signing in you should say use this account everywhere on your device so it's your choice so just basically read through this and then make your choice so <coughs> all right guys i think we have successfully linked our microsoft account so join the windows inside our program we are so we are basically going to choose this register and then join the windows and be first so you just click on sign up i have read you can read you can read through all of these but like i've read and accepted the terms so we're going to go ahead and click on submit so you're good to go so we're going to go ahead and click on close all right right now it says choose your insider settings so basically what you're going to be doing at this stage is to choose what type of insider you want to be registering at so guys the windows insider provider settings has provided for us three types of channel builds that you can apply for now the three of them actually means three levels and they can also change in terms of the way you get updates on your windows pc so quickly for the beta channel it's just the basic part of the windows insider program but it doesn't mean you're not going to be able to get windows updates as quick as possible just that you're not going to get it as fast as those on the dev channel and the express channel but windows actually recommended this one because it's the much more stable one because if you progress to like the dev channel you're going to get an update obviously faster than those on the beta channel but it's not going to be as stable as the ones you get from the beta channel so for the beta channel what you get is already finished updates they don't come with bugs they don't come with glitches so what do people on the dev channel get that the beta channel doesn't get it's the already finished build that they tested or like they've run you know they're still creating it they are not yet sure it can crash it can have bugs it can have problems but you know people on the dev channel can as well get it it just simply means that if you're a windows user and you want to get updates you know as fast as possible regardless of what will come with it you can as well apply for the dev channel but the express channel you know i would say i've not seen any of my friends or anybody that actually you know use the express channel but people out there use the express channel but it's more it's much more of the advanced level one where you get you know updates boom boom windows just do something they push it out to the express people windows do something they push it out but the dev channel they'll kind of you know try to adjust a little bit but it can still get bugs why the beta channels are you know less less bug you know attractive yeah so that means if you're a casual windows user and you want to just you know enjoy your windows and also get something great out of it go for the beta channel which i also advise personally for you guys to go and select if you're a windows professional you can go for the dev channel but if you're just a you know standard windows user on the windows platform today you should definitely go for the beta channel so hopefully this explanation gets you through this phase and you know you know what to click so let's head back to the screen so we are going to go ahead and choose our insider settings and click on the confirm button click on the confirm option and it says here a better windows for everyone so this is an agreement you need to like read confirm and accept before you click on the confirm button so once you're done reading it click on the confirm button and right there it says one more step to go so guys this should basically be like the last and basic step to do what you're going to basically do is to click on the restart button to restart your pc now so that all the updates that are, you know are available at the moment can you know come and take place on your pc so now if we go back to our windows insider page we're going to find out that we have just registered for our beta you know 
version of windows inside that program which we can as well change but that will be like for another video and just to add you can also leave the windows inside that program and if you want me to give you like a breakdown on how to do that in another video feel free to drop it down in the comment section so guys just before you leave this video if you want to watch another helpful video you should go ahead and consider clicking on the video you see right on your screen right now to continue watching my videos and if you enjoy my videos please feel free to subscribe to my channel because it's absolutely free and you can get to see my videos when i upload a brand new video so without further ado i'll see you all in my next video Bye.